uh, we should uh, wait for one or two minutes. Uh, no, I think maximum participant have joined. Uh, no, we should start. Uh, good evening, everyone. I am Dr. Sayyid Atik Hussain, and uh, it's my uh, privilege to welcome you to this existing demo class for our course on advanced data analysis techniques using R and AI tool. This course is specially designed for those participant which are seeking or want to perform uh, data analysis. And they may be a student, a scholar, and um, belong to any field of study. So in this training, we will uh, learn about R programming. Uh, hopefully uh, you are already familiar with R programming. Uh, because uh, R and Python, Pythons are in trending topic. If I show you my previous classes, I have successfully done uh, 25 classes in my previous batches. Uh, if you can see, here are these uh, different batches uh, which I have complete. And uh, now three new batches are going to start in this week. So uh, my last batch, uh, which is completed, is uh, 25th batch. And uh, it is successfully completed. And now all participants are satisfied and uh, they are working uh, on their own data set for analysis. So it is very helpful for those uh, which are uh, enrolled in PAD and postdoc or a master studies. So it is very helpful for uh, students and uh, researchers as well. So what you will learn in this course? And uh, after completion this course, which type of analysis you will be able to perform? So our first question is, what you are going to learn? In this course, you first learn R programming. In R programming, because R programming, uh, R is a, a com computer language and it is a multi-purpose language. So we should use it for data analysis. And uh, at basic, we will learn it's how to uh, read, write, edit, and generate 
script for data analysis. So it is our basic step. And after completion this step, we will be able to perform lot of analysis and uh, including uh, I already send you the list of analysis. You can see here Uh, you will be able to learn uh, introduction to R programming and basic uh, syntax variables and data types, data structures, vector matrix, data frames, basic data manipulations and processing, introduction to ggplot2 for basic graphings and uh, practical. Uh, you will also perform these uh, practically. So uh, be remember it is not a course, it is a training and you will perform all these uh, analysis uh, live in, uh, uh, in in our class. So if you found any error, I will resolve your error during class. So next you will be able to uh, perform uh, use of ChatGPT. It is a very advanced AI tools and then uh, practice on descriptive statistics and data summarizations, basic in frontal statistics, uh, t-test, ANOVA, etc and regression analysis, it may be linear, logistic, and many more. A similar the principal component analysis for uh, dimensional reductions, correlation analysis, heat map visualizations, cluster analysis, and in advanced tools, uh, you will be able to uh, analyze this score. This topic is just only for uh, specific for ecological participant, but uh, it is not limited to uh, all participant uh, like economics, uh, a business or other fields can uh, join and get equal benefit from this training. And the next is specialized techniques in ecological evolutions like uh, PCA, CA, DCA, and CCA. And uh, others are uh, after completion of this course, you will be able to perform any task which you have in your mind. For example, when participant uh, uh, get complete course and uh, successfully uh, get all uh, these steps and um, have basic expertise, uh, no, he will be able to perform any analysis. For example, if a participant uh, belong to economics, after getting this training, he will be perform analysis related to biology, analysis related to economics, analysis related to uh, geography, analysis related to uh, business, Similarly, a participant belong to chemistry. Uh, after getting this training, he will be able to perform all type of analysis except few analysis like ecological modeling and uh, some genomic analysis because uh, techniques for these analysis is uh, different. So you are unable to perform genomic analysis and molecular and ecological modeling file. Uh, some while others all analysis you can done by using these techniques. So uh, what uh, will we need to install for this analysis? Because uh, this training we are going to perform on our programming. So first we need our programming. And second is we need our studio. This training is similarly like to a uh, car or vehicles because I give an uh, example of vehicle because it is very similar or close to uh, this R programming. For example, if you want to uh, learn driving or uh, for example, you buy a car and your purpose for uh, this car is uh, driving this car from home to university or uh, university to other cities. Uh, then uh, then you will be uh, then you need to learn driving of this car, not its engineering. So uh, you learn its driving and after driving, you can uh, travel a lot of ways. Similarly in R, when you have R, when you able to drive R, you can perform all type of analysis by using R. 
Uh, I get a questions. Yes. Uh, Mr. Sami, uh, you can perform genomics and trans transcriptomic analysis, but uh, you need some special uh, techniques because uh, you can perform uh, genomics analysis, protomics analysis, or ecological modeling in R, but this training is designed for uh, other uh, other analysis, not you know, for genomics, because in genomics we have uh, some heavy files and the format is different. Fast, faster, faster file, fast queue files are uh, in some other file formats. So uh, the handling these genomic analysis is. Uh, different because packages, uh, the packages which are required for uh, genomic and protomics analysis is are different. So uh, in limited time, there is a uh, no enough uh, uh, space or time to complete genomics course uh, with this course. So I have designed another course named Genomic Analysis with R. Uh, after completion this course, you can join this course. This is a 10 day course and uh, you can perform all uh, genomics and protomics analysis by using um, this course. But uh, the basic is uh, you need to learn R. When you uh, have learned R, you just need to uh, guide how do we uh, done genomic analysis. So just uh, the difference is the uh, file. In normal data set, we have only our data in CSV file or Excel file format. But when you perform genomics or other uh, protomics or molecular analysis, you have some different file formats and handling with these files format is difficult as compared to uh, normal uh, X, Excel or CSV files. Okay, now uh, for learning this training, we need uh, two programs. One is R and second is R Studio. So in demo class, I will install and uh, guide you how to install R and R Studio. Uh, within our laptop. So all participants, please be ready uh, for installations of R and R Studio. Uh, and uh, one more uh, thing I want to say before going to start installation. So please be ready for installation. And uh, I want to say one more thing is why we prefer R. Although other tools, lot of tools like uh, Excel Stat, SPSS, Minitabs, and other tools are available, then why we ch choose this uh, difficult and uh, uh, complicated tools for data analysis? Because the first way it is uh, in trend, in trending topic. Second, R is free. R is totally free. You don't need to pay any for installation and downloading of R. So please, all uh, while the other tools uh, need, while the other tools need uh, annually registration, and you need to pay uh, its fees for downloading and installations. But uh, some participants uh, uh, can use. Uh, I may use uh, crack versions, but it is not a good because crack version mean we have changed its uh, coding, but it show you uh, uh, results, but uh, it is uh, not good because if you uh, write in your research paper, I have done this uh, by using crack version. Your paper uh, at the spot hopefully will be rejected because you are using crack version. It is an illegal way to use other tools. So uh, the good option is we can use R because it is a totally free and uh, we don't need to pay anything. And the most important thing about R, you can perform all type of analysis in R. While other tools provide limited uh, analysis, for example, uh, when you perform, uh, when you are going to write uh, your thesis and you want to perform analysis, and uh, you have a different type of analysis, for example, some basic analysis, ANOVA, heat map, correlation, you can done with uh, by using SPSS and uh, some other basic tools. But when you have some molecular analysis or geographical analysis or ecological modeling, you are unable to uh, perform uh, these analysis within some basic tools. So you need to convert or into uh, convert to your skills into or our advanced tools. So it is a better way 
टू परफॉर्म आर वर्क इन आर इंस्टेड ऑफ अदर सॉफ्टवेयर सो इफ यू लर्न आर यू डोंट नीड टू लर्न ट्वेंटी थर्टी एंड मोर टूल्स फॉर डेट एनालिसिस while if you learn uh, spss you need to more tools for data analysis if you learn mini tab you need more tools for more data analysis but if you learn r r is enough for all type of data analysis okay and uh, now uh, we are going to install hopefully r participant uh, yes uh, it is similar uh, to python if you are familiar with python or matlab uh, then you can easily perform analysis on r or if you have learned r then the python and matlab is very easy for you because uh, uh, it is a similar as uh, ms word and excel for example you if you are seeing my screen here this is a r studio and if i click on here here is a r and show you you can see in here python so you can use r or python within r studio so if you uh, learn r then python is not difficult for you you just need mm, the differences between the python and r is just only for packages while the working of these both is same so the please all participant please uh, try to install open google chrome or any other browsers which uh, you are using please open google chrome type here r crane no the first website which is shown uh, the comprehensive r archive network here is a latest version r 4.3.3 maybe some parts went have already have r uh, please check uh, r version because uh, our work on latest versions so here is the latest work version is 4.3.3 so click on this uh, r for window click and uh, when you click on this step on this option it will show you another page for download so download r 4.3.3 for window so click on this button no uh, after uh, click it will ask you where you want to save this file so i suggest desktop you can save it anywhere where you want to save so click on save after few minutes i think it take one or two minute it it's showing me two minutes after 2 minute it will uh, download so uh, please all participant let me know have you done this step if you are uh, trying to download please all participant let me know have you done this step and downloading is start okay all participant please uh, download uh, this file and after downloading please type done after download please type done in my case it is showing uh, 46 seconds hopefully i uh, will install soon okay okay now i want to share a screen of uh, someone if anyone uh, willing to share your screen i allow you please share your screen i will uh, perform installation process on your screen because i already have this package so if i want to try uh, if i try to install it will uh, don't allow me to reinstall this package so uh, i am going to uh, give access 
if any participant want to share your screen uh, i will perform other steps on your screen so kindly share your screen any participant can share uh, which uh, who have downloaded it Uh, Sayed Basit Ali Shah. Okay. Okay, good. Okay. Uh, please cancel, uh, press cancel. Also, please open your mic. <clears throat> okay. Uh, please uh, click and double click on this file R4.3.3. Please double click on it. Okay. And uh, now it's showing that select the language to use during the installation. Uh, English, it's okay. Click okay. No, it's showing uh, you a license uh, and uh, showing please read the following important information before continuing. If you want to read, you can read otherwise uh, click on next button. No, uh, here uh, uh, your program is asking where uh, you want to save this program or install it. So by default, it is selected C. So click on next button. Don't disturb it. Just click on next button. Okay, again, next button. Okay, again, next button. You don't need to any change here. So again, click on next button. And uh, uh, click on create a quick launch shortcut. Second point. Yes. And press next button. So all participants, please install this package uh, by using or uh, by uh, completing this step. Okay, click on finish and uh, open your desktop. Check on desktop. Here is R. So click on R. So this is the R programming. So all participants perform this step download and install and after downloading and installation please type done okay uh, thank you uh, sir now i'm going to close yes, your sir. screen okay. so after completion this step we uh, need another package name r studio this is the R programming. We need uh, another package name R Studio. So open new tab. Just click here. R Studio download. The first website that is poised, it is the official website of R Studio. Click on this R Studio desktop. Now, here are, you can see two options. First is install R and second is install R Studio. 
but uh, the R in R, uh, the required version is 3.3.0. It is very old version of R. So we don't need to install R from R Studio because R Studio uh, Poised website have oldest version of R. The latest, latest version is 4.3.3, but in Poised website it is 3.3.0. So we need to install R Studio from this website because the latest version of R Studio is found here. It is updated on uh, 29 January uh, 24 so you can download it click on download our studio desktop for window if you have other uh, tools like Mac or other uh, operating system uh, you can download uh, for uh, below uh, by selecting your desired operating system now i have window uh, hopefully uh, mostly participants have window so click on download r studio for window it also asks you about location where you want to save so also save it on desktop or anywhere uh, where you want to save it also take uh, uh, five to ten minutes so it's working so all participant uh, click on download button and start download while it is starting while it is sorry while it is downloading uh, I want to share some other things. So, in in our demo class, I just want to show you the method how I teach and how you learn. In this training session, uh, you will learn live. There is no book, there is no notes, only training. You will perform each and everything live with me. And uh, when I perform step, you will follow. And if you found any error, I will share your screen and resolve this error, uh, this error live. So after completion this class, when for example first our demo class uh, completed and after completion uh, or end i will share the recorded video of this class you can also uh, do practice by watching this video and uh, for example if you uh, skip or absent in any class you can watch video and do practice and if you found any issues uh, any error you can contact me uh, through whatsapp uh, messenger or any way other way or uh, you can call me for uh, discussing about this error anytime so the training method is It is live training. Live. We will use Zoom for training. And after training, recorded video will be shared in group you can discuss question or ask ask questions after uh, after class or any time or day no uh, next time how to get registration
uh, you need to uh, provide some basic information including name name degree university name email id and p receipt participant from pakistan can pay through a bank account other other countries from uh, can use ibn number and while participant from china can pay through alipay after payment i will add you in the new batch name registered participant so the next classes will be uh, shared in a link will be shared in uh, registered participant batch and uh, demo class group will be removed after uh, a registration uh, only 20 seats Total seats are 20 and uh, three are already filled. Okay, and our classes schedules are from Monday to Thursday. So today is the Thursday. So our next first class uh, will be on coming Monday. Okay, hopefully uh, I have, I think I have uh, download our studio. Uh, so please uh, let me know, uh, have you uh, download our studio? All participants please confirm me, have you download our studio? If you have done, please type done. and uh, anyone please can share your screen okay okay now i'm uh, again uh, going to allow you uh, please share your screen okay uh, please double click on this app r studio Click on next button. Next. Install. Click on install. All participants, please follow these instructions and install our studio. It will take uh, some time.
Okay, click on finish. Okay, uh, please open, uh, come on uh, uh, at the start button. Uh, here is a search bar, yes. Uh, search here, R Studio. R Studio. Yes. This one, select and click. Uh, please uh, select uh, option number three, choose a specific version of R. Yes, this one. Please select, uh, yeah. no, 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 please wait. Uh, no, click on uh, 64 bit C programming files after R uh, choose specific, yes, click on it and press OK. OK. Please click on OK button. Uh, click on no. Okay. No, when you install it first time, it will show you three screens, three windows. Like uh, uh, first is uh, um, first one is a uh, bigger screen, while two are smaller. One is showing environment is empty, and other is showing some files. So uh, in screen number one, here is a minimize and maximize button. On screen number one, at the end, uh, please let me share my screen. When you open, open our studio first time, it will show you like this. But uh, here is a uh, minimize and maximize button. Just click on maximize button. It will show you another screen. This is screen number one. And this is screen number two. This is screen number three. And this is screen number four. Screen number one, two, three, and four. And uh, one more important thing is that uh, if you belong to any field of study, uh, you can join this training. It is equally uh, beneficial for all field of studies. So because it is the basic training of reading, writing, editing of our language. And after basic training, you will get uh, advanced training in this training. And you will uh, perform advanced uh, data analysis techniques uh, for uh, data analysis. So now if you have any specific question, uh, you can ask. You can raise your hand, I will open your mic. I allowed all participants. Please, if anyone have a question, I can ask.
okay uh, no question no. so uh, today our get a message class time okay class time will be same as today 8 to 9 p.m according to china time and uh, 5 to 6 p.m according to pakistan time if you are uh, in usa uh, uh, you can join uh, usa time class um, because uh, two batches are going to start one is according to china time class and one is according to uh, uh, usa time okay said gul i have two batches one is 30 i think you are add in two batches one is uh, uh, 30 and one is 29 you are attending no the uh, demo class of 29 and this uh, batch is according to china time uh, but uh, if you are in usa you can uh, get uh, the demo class in usa time uh, which is uh, according to usa time 8 to 9 pm not according to china time okay uh, training will uh, be about for 10 to 15 days but hopefully i will guarantee you guarantee you you will be able to perform lot of analysis even which analysis you have in your mind you can see in any paper you just need to know its name if you know analysis name you can perform analysis after getting eight day training and while remaining days we will perform uh, practice on your own data set you can use your own data set uh, and uh, you can perform analysis according to your research not uh, these mentioned in course you can perform those analysis which are required for your research perform if you found any errors you can discuss this analysis with me but in previous eight days classes you need to focus on just uh, limited files uh, which are uh, which i will share with you because uh, this is a, a training session when you will get basic training then you can uh, do analysis on your own file on your own data uh, according to your uh, research demand you can perform different analysis and if you found any error uh, during analysis on your own data set then you can discuss within class uh, sir i found uh, uh, this type of error how i arrange this data set for this type of analysis i will guide you accordingly okay uh, i will uh, share all details uh, within group about uh, classes and uh, fee pay decisions uh, soon okay thanks and if you have more questions i uh, i already have uh, open uh, whatsapp group for chat you can share your uh, uh, reviews about uh, today demo class and uh, you can also ask questions uh, within uh, whatsapp group okay thanks okay now our first class will be on uh, coming monday